Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to show you step by step process how you can use sign now. In this video I will show you how you can upload a document, how you can create a document, how you can send a document and also how you can simply create a template. So let's start. Now when you come here you will see on the left side upload documents. So what you can do is just simply click on it and then let's I'm going to choose my invoice here. Okay and I have the invoice. From the invoice in your documents, you can simply invite someone to sign, make a template or click more and you can email, copy, create an invite link, download, delete document, archive. So plenty of things here. I'm going to click invite to sign. And the first thing what is going to happen that you need to add a name here like signer or I'm going to add Marcus and then I'm going to add a mail here. Okay. What you can do is to add a CC or you can add a new person here. So I'm going to add Marcus Olek. Let's go. And I'm going to have two signers. Click or drag a signer here to add a new signing step. This is something that you can actually do. So these signers sign after all signers in Priya group sign. So when the Marek Kamenitsky zero is going to sign, then I'm going to get uh, the Juna here will get a sign here. So that's what you can do, but I'm going to have only one sign in step. You can also add a CC here. You're going to see the recent signers here that you like added that you can simply use again. Now let's start adding fields. So I have the invoice here and let's say that I want to have a I want to create a sign here. So what I will do is that I can add signature field and what you need to do is to take it and just add it here. Then you can simply choose another person here and again take signature field. And now I can add simple text field or date time field, calculated field, initials, checkbox, drop down field, stamp field and you can also add a my signature, my stamp text today's date and my check. So I can add simple text field here and I can move it. Same thing. I'm going to add a text field here. Okay. And now I can add, let's say that I want to add a date time field, make it bigger and same with date time field. And voila, here we got a basic for signing. Now when I have it, uh, what you can do is so just like zooming in if you want to with a plus here. And these are like the basics what you can actually do. Then go to top right and you're going to see save and invite. So click on it. And what is going to happen is that, okay, I see that. Review and send at the same time or in order. You can add a CC recipient on last time. And when I have it, I'm going to click send invite. And I'm going to show you how it's going to look like right now. I'm going to get an email. Okay, and now we have it. View document. You can select language here. And now what I have to do is to simply add a date. Then I can add a, this is a text field and I can simply signature field here. I can change the signature. I can draw or upload. Sign and voila, this is how you can simply sign a document uh, in sign now when you're going to send it to someone and I'm just going to top right click done. So this is how it works. And this is how we can do it with sign now. When I go further to going back. I can click also on the template and I can create a template from document. And I have the document here. So I can do it right there or I can upload. And right now what you're going to do is to pre-create, pre-create everything. And then you just like easier sign it, right? So I'm going to edit right here start adding fields and I'm going to add a text field. Let's say I'm going to add signature field like this and I can click save and invite. 
and voila, right then I'm going to send invite. And what can I do is to use the template for every time, right? Done. So this is what you can do actually. And now when I go to template, I can invite to sign again and just like automate it. And this is pretty much it how sign up works. So thank you very much guys for watching. If you have any questions, ask me down in the comments. I'm really happy to help you and provide you some guidance. And yeah, have a great day and goodbye. See ya.